What is up YouTube? It's in time video guy here doing a special video since my PS3 is currently updating again. Um this is my 1972 Yamaha U7e currently being restored. I have a toothbrush there to clean it. Um it's pretty much in good condition. Original tire is nice and full. Nice solid as a rock actually because I filled them up a little too much, but I'm getting there. Missing the engine. The engine's in here. It is almost fully put together. I need two gears for it, which are on the inside. Um, the one that you can currently see that's stripped out inside of there. Um, I don't know what it's called, but it's there and it's broke. So I need that. Um, I need a piston, which is in there and... Like, I have it in this bag somewhere, but, yeah. Um, crappy seat, but it is original. Getting a new one. Missing the lid. For that. I never looked in there, so this is actually news to me. Ugh. It's actually pretty clean, actually. Nice. Not the original speedometer. The original one is inside that box on the table. Um, it's been broken, so... <laughs> Yeah, got the little turn signals here, but as you can tell, I don't have any. Um, the light bulb, I'm kind of worried about this. That goes for the back light, which I do have. I don't know what that is, but it's there. Original kickstand. Uh, nice bike. Been sitting for 15 years. Finally gonna restart it. Sorry about moving the camera so much. There's some of the parts I have. An L filter. Here's the original speedometer. Well, that's kinda messed up. So yeah, that's never gonna be used again. Got some other parts in here. This is for the purse, this is not for the bike. I don't know why I have it. Um I got a Kickstarter here, I think, I don't know, I don't know what that is, but it's in there, I got two Kickstarts so I know that, nice condition box, there's really no rust on it, well actually there is no rust on this bike at all, honestly, just a little damage to the fender, a little damage to that, um, only rust, honestly, is right there. Like, underneath is pretty not rusty at all. Like, um, I'll, I can't see it, but I'll try to get the best video I can of it. It is very dirty. I haven't cleaned the bottom. No rust in there either. So, this bike is 100% rust free. I love it. What kind of bike nowadays could sit for 15 years and not be rusty? It was also in like three crashes, so. It was in a crash where my uncle started tail whipping and cracked into a tree, and all that happened was this. Like it cracked a little bit. And. I don't know what these are. If anyone could tell me what this is, please do. I, I don't know if it goes to the bike or not. I don't know. Um, this, I believe it's the original, and my uncle, my grandfather bought me this one. Oh, well, he didn't buy me it, but he bought it and never put it on. So this is the original, that's the... I would say the original too, but it's like the bought original. So, got the tail light here. I'll try to take that out for y'all. I'm on a 150 budget on this bike. I only need three things so far, which is those two gears. Obviously that, because I don't think there's no repair on this. So yeah. The two gears, air filter, and um, sparkler. That's it. Can't get this out of the bag. Haha, <laughs> there we go. So yeah, um, it's a little messed up. I mean, also like 35 bucks, so I'm happy it's not completely broke. I'm definitely going to use it. When I put lights on it, because that's not my main priority. 
Vampire already is actually getting a status. This may not go back in the bag yet, but it went back in the bag. Yes. Alright, um, there's something else I wanted to show y'all. I don't know what. Huh. I don't know. Um, the bulbs look actually pretty good. And I believe they are original, so I don't know. Ooh, I hope they're original, because... Dang. Holy crap. Yeah, I don't want to break that, so I'm not doing that now. I need gloves for that. Got the pegs here. Not not bent at all, just kind of wobbly, but... Yeah. Um, you've got a Hearn on this side. And a Easy Star on this side. None of this right here is original. All of that's kind of custom. They used to have a hand throttle. But, um... That's camp, by the way. Um, I don't know what happened to it, but my grandfather decided to put a thumb throttle in. I guess it was easier than doing that, because if you fall or do it really too hard, you're going to really crank down. Uh, I don't know what this is. I don't know what goes in there. I believe the mirror. I don't know. Random line here for the spark plug, I believe. There's really not much more in there, other than a bunch of wires and crap. This is my mini bike, by the way. A uh, little dirt bug. I popped the clutch on it. Well, I didn't pop the clutch, it blew up. Uh, original chain. My PS3 should be... Oh crap, okay. <laughs> it didn't fall. Nice. Nice. PS3 should be done updating by now, but I don't really care. I'll be uploading that video soon, it's kind of hysterical. Uh, but yeah, that gear right in there, the, 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 that one, like, crap. Wow. Oh, that one right there. The middle one that you see. I need to know what gear that is. It goes from this side of the engine to that side. It's like one rod and there's only one gear right in the middle. I don't want to separate it because I'm going to lose everything that's in it already. So I'm just going to push that back. I'm losing bags here. I ain't good. Kickstart number one. Kickstart number two. Why I have two, but yeah, oh well. Um, got the shifter right in that bag there. It's semi auto, so the shifter really ain't gonna do much. Um, what's that speedometer at? There it is. On the original speedometer, it has um. 3,352 miles. That's a, that's a 3, not a 9, by the way. There we go. So, it's not bad. And on the other speedometer, it has 2,000. So, altogether, I mean, it really wasn't ran too much for being a 72. Um, I'll get a good video over here. Nice and shiny. Look at the shine. It used to be an orange. It used to be that color orange right there. And my grandfather sanded it down and painted it all in like, well, like maybe 15 years ago. And the only paint that's actually coming off right now is right there. But I believe that happened on the truck. So. Very, very, very good back tire. I had to say very like seven times because that's like brand new. Um, brakes were perfect. I can't wait to start it. So, uh, brakes are very good. Um, 
original cover. So yeah, let me know what y'all think of this. Um, give me advice. I am always open to ideas and always open to find parts for it. Like I said, I need two parts for the engine. Oh yeah, I also need a clutch too. The clutch is kind of missing pieces and I cannot find one on eBay that would fit this. So um, let me know where I could find a clutch cheap and the gears for the engine. Could you guys let me know where I could find those too? Um, just put them down in the comments. Any way you want. This video is starting to get a little long, so I'm going to wrap it up here. Um, like, subscribe for um, restoration videos. Every time I buy a new part that I'm putting on, I'll show the aftermath of it on it. And hopefully it'll be running within a month or two. So yeah. Later.